is good YouTube. It's your girl Brinks, and I'm coming to you guys with another DIY. There we go. DIY video. A quick one at that. So um I'm about to get started on TK's Christmas tree and everything. And I just wanted to bring you guys a quick DIY about ornaments. So you guys know Aww. that I laminate ornaments. And we just stick, simply stick the hooks through there. Or you can even use ribbon to tie it off. Um, that's one way to do do some ornaments. But another really cheap and effective way to do ornaments is just look for some little figurines of whatever character that you're going to use on your kid's Christmas tree. So I found these on Amazon. They were like $10, 10 to $12 one of those ranges and they came with like 12 different things so i bought them so these are like perfect little ornament sizes um <clears throat> get these you could get some um just a combination of what type of ornaments you guys want to put them on um i am going to attempt doing this on some snowflakes and then um, I had these, but I tested it out and they're all too wide to try to fit in here and they don't squeeze or anything. So it's not going to work. I have ribbon. And of course, I have some ornament hooks. You guys see that? Okay. And last but not least, I have some hot glue. So I'm just going to show you guys a couple of different ways that you can do some different ornament things. Um, first, oh. you mind. So this was a, an eraser. I found this at um, Walmart in like the party aisle section, and it just had SpongeBob on there. Take you mind. It just had SpongeBob. Um, and a pack of four for these erasers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to line this up with the middle of spongebob's head and then i'm just going to apply some hot glue dead smacks to the middle of it like i have four of them but tk wound up literally using is it even warming up yes but tk wound up using it and so now i can't use it because it doesn't like the pants come off he like literally pulled oh, the pants off no. <laughs> so i'm just adding some hot glue and i just lost my freaking hook y'all what the heck <sighs> grab another one hopefully this is not dry yet grab a hook and stick that straight down in the middle Hold it while it dries. Oh, no. I'm going to add a little bit more to the top. Alright guys, so that may look no. a little weirdy sloppy, but it works. And now, now we have an ornament. A hubby Spongebob ornament that you can put on a tree. Yeah, it's, this hook is not going anywhere. Bruh. Hey, move, man. You in the middle of the video. Back up. So, yeah, you guys, that's one way you can do ornaments. So, now I'm about to show you guys. All right, y'all. So, now we are going to use one of our snowflakes. Same thing with the snowflakes, you guys. And this one has like a nice little center that you can put like literally anything. Let's see, we'll use this Patrick one. So, they're literally going to take some hot glue, put it on the back. Of Patrick 
this one will be a lot more seamless and less visible for the fact that you won't really see all of it. Yes, cutie. You won't really see it. And you just press and let it dry. This one is actually really cute, you know. That's creative. I don't even know how I come up with some of this stuff. Honestly, I just do. If it seems like it's not sticking, go ahead and add a little bit extra glue, you guys. Let it dry. And voila, you guys have another ornament. Ornament. Like, dope. You guys, how neat is that? So, like, I have an assortment of different ornaments that I'm going to be putting on this tree. I literally have... Um, six of these snowflakes so i'm going to do six different characters on the snowflakes um i have two of the little spongebob um two of the spongebob erasers left the other two like i told you guys he broke the pants off so it's a wrap <laughs> can't use that um that's it for that and then one last way Let's see i want to try to you can use this another SpongeBob. Uh, so this one is actually perfect. So for this one, I'm gonna use an actual ornament ball this time. And we are gonna use this SpongeBob. We're gonna put the glue right on top of his head. Right on top of his head, and it's gonna look like he's actually holding this ornament up. And then we're just going to place the ornament right smack dab in that glue on top of his head. Try to keep it as clean as possible, y'all. Let it dry. Still drying, but voila, voila, y'all! Like how cute is that? <laughs> that is so dope. Okay, I don't actually do not know how I come up with this stuff, you guys. I just kind of think and get my like creative ideas flowing, and that is just kind of what happens when I think creatively like that. So. So what I came up with for that one, I'm going to use, I like this one. So I'll put Gary on the side of this white one. So I'm just going to place it. Anything that has like a flat surface um, is good for like hanging or attaching stuff to ornament balls. And you guys like, this is literally my first time doing this. So I just want to pass the details along for you guys to help you kind of have like an easier way to do things as well and you can literally get ornaments from dollar tree to try this like these ornaments came from walmart so they were like i want to say is it on here they were six dollars 5.98 so all in all it's not really a super expensive diy but like you could literally could do it with like a lot less money than I did with all Dollar Tree items, especially if the characters that you're trying to do it with, Dollar Tree has like action figures and stuff for like, it just works out that way y'all. Just gotta be creative and know what you're doing. Try to go, just go for it. And now we have this cute little Gary. We have this cute Gary ornament. Alright, so I'm going to put Sandy on a snowflake. These snowflakes were actually from Dollar Tree, y'all, so. Yep. 
not that much money spent on this at all. Super budget friendly. Super cost effective. And this back there. Standing right there. In the middle. Press and hold. Press and hold. I did try. Have to get some more glue on her top, you guys. Oh. Firmly hold if you can. If it's not too hot, firmly hold it. Firmly grip it. Firmly grip it. Seriously, <laughs> mommy. Patrick was like that. <laughs> SpongeBob. All right, y'all. Oh, now we have a sandy ornament. Bowie Griffin. Aww. All righty, guys. So you now have multiple cost-effective ways that you guys can do some freaking ornaments for the low low. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little DIY. Comment and let me know what you think. And until next time, you guys, see ya.